Hey, hey, hello, guys. I am Tangar Game Glass, and this is Stukense, Russian beauty, Rusi Pushi. <laughs> Rusi, how, how, what is your gaming name? Rusi Game. Rusi Game, sorry. <laughs> Rusi Pushi. <laughs> so, guys, uh, right now I am in the Netherlands. Beautiful Dutch weather and center of. Lachenhen. It's a city, quite small city, but very nice one. So, uh, I want to speak about online games, and this is just not just regular video. Stukense would be our interviewer. She would ask me questions, and I'll give her answers. Are you ready? Let's go. So, what is the worst online game right now? <laughs> and uh, actually, I think that uh, whole uh, genre, more PG genre, most of uh, like prime AAA more PG ga games, they went to the wrong di direction, and uh, it's kind of um, degradation of our favorite genre. But. If you ask about particular game, the worst RPG game, I can't say because uh, I just do not play bad games. I'm trying to not play bad games, and I think the more the worst one is just uh, yet another um, Korean clone game. Of, there are so much Korean clones around, and yeah, <laughs> that's it. I think. Um, there are so much the worst games ever around. So you don't yeah. like Korean games? No, I like Korean games. Korean games, sometimes they have very um, cool stuff. For example, even uh, this Black Desert, it's Korean game. And some, a lot of others, um, quite good more PGs, they're from Korea. So. And our mobile from Korea. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And I have another question for you. So, uh, what game you play right now? I play Tamnet. And the next question is, how did you choose uh, to start play Tamnet? Why you why you start play Tamnet? Mm, long time ago, I, accidentally, I I've looked for any online roguelike game just to, to try something like NetHack Online. And once I used uh, Google, I just typed like online regular game and I uh, appeared at Tamnet website. I uh, registered there, like in, into the game. I didn't understood nothing. Very strange place. It was uh, like this old school ACI graphics, but uh, yeah, it was, it was like this. And uh, so now you play this game for three uh, years. For three years, and you play this game every day. Yeah, yeah. Not not every day. Sometimes I make breaks. And I would like to ask you, uh, in if you will compare um, this gameplay to any other online game you have ever played, which game will you pick by your entertaining feelings? Oh, you know, actually, if we would look into popular games, Tamnet, it's the game closest to Diablo. Because actually Diablo, uh, first part of Diablo and all others, they were uh, like, they Blizzard inspired from Rogulai games, from Moria. And actually, uh, if we would look into gender tree, like this, uh, how it would be. Radovoy Zerevo. This uh, tree of how... Uh, Ancestors. Ancestors tree. Uh, how Rogue-like gender developed. We would see Rogue game. And then from Rogue it uh, come Moria from one side and Hack to another. Then from Hack uh, appeared Net Hack. And from Moria appeared Angband. And from Angband actually appeared Tomnet. So 
Antonet. Also interesting thing for Antonet is <laughs> what, what I play. Mm -hmm. And also interesting thing that uh, uh, Diablo developers, they inspired by uh, Moria. Mm -hmm. So uh, we could say that Tamnet and Diablo, they had uh, main uh, parent, actually. Mm -hmm. And it's very interesting thing. Yeah. Yeah. So basically, if you like to play Diablo, you would like to play Tamnet. Yeah, yeah. If you like to play Diablo, you would definitely love to play Tamnet if you get into it. And if you like to play World of Warcraft? Uh, I'll say two. Yeah, you would be interested because uh, but Tamnet, it's not just a Diablo-like game. It's more or less, as I think it's more PG because in Tamnet you could have a house where a lot like uh, uh, huge game world and so much different um, events and Tamnet is much more richer in gameplay uh, game than Diablo. But uh, you said that uh, if I like to play World of Warcraft or any other game, so which part of this game closest to Tamnet is a um, system of having houses or is it system of killing monsters or, or is it system of I having see. pets what is what is it uh, actually mm, in, in Diablo you didn't have uh, pets yes. in first and second part so but you have a lot of skeletons. Yeah, <laughs> skeletons. Yeah. I'll say, you see, uh, what is the main purpose of your gameplay in Diablo? To crush everything around. Yeah, and in Tamnet it's the same. Yes. But in Tamnet you also uh, crush everything around, but in Tamnet you also could uh, destroy environment. In Diablo you can't destroy walls. And in Tamnet but it's you possible. Can destroy barrels. Yeah, you could destroy barrels. And in Tomnet there is no barrels. Oh, it's a good idea to add barrels to Tomnet. I'll yeah. suggest it to developers. Thank you. <laughs> I like to crush barrels. It's your idea. It's cool. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I like to crush barrels a lot. Okay, yeah, I like to crush and barrels And I like too. to find something inside the barrels very much. Oh, yeah. Like a treasure. Oh, yeah. Or skeletons. Oh, yeah. Come on. So, next question. <laughs> so, next question for you. So, uh, would you, if, if um, a, any developer would come to you, like a developer of any very rich company of the gaming, and he say, hey Tangar, I would like to create a game for you, so because you're a very good streamer and, oh, and yeah. you're a very nice guy, I would like to create a game by your plan. So, how much money do you need? Uh, I'll say to this guy, I'll say this. Let's create a thumbnet uh, wrapper. Thumbnet wrapper with 3D graphics. <laughs> what is a wrapper? A So actually, what, what we could... What I'm thinking ah, right now. What like, a, yeah. like, like a beautiful skeletons and yeah. characters. Actually, right now, right now, I, I think... See. Look, look, look. It's a very interesting thing. Actually, Tamnet is open source game, mm -hmm. and uh, anyone could make his own addition to this game, and uh, could make like um, graphics. Like he could add any graphics. Actually, it's possible to add to Tamnet, like f make it f totally in 3D. Mm -hmm. And uh, also, the, right now, there is how it called necklace of eye or something like this and for Angband, ancestor of the net uh, they made um, kind of demonstration how you could play with it i don't think that Tamnet in 3g it would be like um, super playable it would Why? be because it would be hard to read the game to understand what's happening but actually but at least uh, if it would be okay we could make it like uh, total, uh, totally good drone, 2D uh, tile set, or uh, like th 3D tile set even. Mm -hmm. So actually, I think uh, if Tamnet would have better 
interface. So the, the only problem of Tamnet, it's user interface. Um, actually, it's not a problem because, um, okay, even right now it's, it's a problem, I'll say, even to me. I get used to it, I have, I made some tweaks to it, but still it's biggest problem of Tamnet, it's user interface. So if it would be um, enhanced, Tamnet would become very popular game. And also, I would suggest to make not, not even graphics, but interface. Yeah. Yes, and I would suggest that it would be possible to play on my uh, my telephone. <laughs> no, it, because it's too small. How you would I, play? I want this to be uh, to be like a square. I can see on my phone and play. But your phone is small, tiny, and yeah, internet is uh, important. Like uh, you know, like Clash Royale. I like Clash Royale very much. So if I would okay. like, if I would can play. This maybe, maybe, the actually, maybe it's possible to make uh, very, small, very small tiny. Dungeons. Yeah, maybe it's possible to make very tiny. Room. No. What? Uh, very tiny tile set. I could make it actually. Very tiny tile set, so it would be e easy to see it like this in closer look. Maybe we could do it. But it's, it's not. It's internet. I would like to have it with me you now. Okay, you could steal from your phone, phone when you're in, in shop, in the net, in the mm -hmm. game. Uh, you could play a thief there. Oh, I see. So, guys, uh, please tell you, tell us what do you think about this little video, this little interview. Thank you very much for interesting questions. Thank you very much for your interesting answers. We're waiting for your comments. See you. Bye.